right. We seem to have politics now brewing around Prime Minister Modi visiting Team India players at the dressing room post the finals of the World Cup. Politics now as it escalates with uh, Sena and TMC hitting out at Prime Minister Modi. Uh, Shiv Sena UBT says players looked very uncomfortable around the Prime Minister. While TMC's Azad says dressing room is sanctum sanctorium. Prime Minister should have met players outside. These are comments coming in from the uh, TMC and the Sena. While the Sena says that all those players looked uncomfortable around Prime Minister Modi. While you have the TMC saying that it's the dressing room is sanctum sanctorium, Prime Minister shouldn't have gone inside there. Palmi Saha joining us on the phone line. Palmi, as expected, they could have been. Uh, it was expected for the opposition to react, and here they claim the players were looking uncomfortable. That's right. Uh, you know, reactions that are coming in from opposition uh, leaders, uh, of course, uh, some of them saying that, you know, the players look uncomfortable. Uh, this is a moment when uh, they would have wanted to spend, uh, spend in private. Uh, you know, of course, assessing uh, their defeat at the hands of Australia. The Prime Minister uh, coming in is not helping at all. And then, of course, uh, you heard from the TMC as well. Keith is our TMC leader, has said, and he says that I speak as a sportsman, as a cricketer and not as a politician. The dressing room is a sanctum sanctorum. That is where only players and their private staff, support staff, are allowed in. The Prime Minister, if he wanted to meet with the players, he could have met them in the private visitors area. Uh, Follow me, stay with us. We have Kitia Azar joining us on the phone line uh, for a little more on that, on the react, on, on the comment made by the TMC. Kitia Azar, here is uh, Prime Minister Modi seen visibly uh, wishing the Team India players. They seem quite disappointed and upset. Prime Minister Modi's pep talk wasn't that the need of the hour? What do you say? Uh, do you think uh, had the Prime Minister not been there, they would have gone into mental depression? Are you trying to imply that? Minister of the country, is it not his duty to be meeting with the players? What's wrong? Well, fair enough. If there's anything wrong, if his the party loses, can I go and meet him in his uh, bedroom, dressing room or his toilet and console him? Well, you're not equa you're equating sports with a political party. Well, fair enough. The politician has come to the sports room. He's the prime minister. We are looking at him as a bipartisan fair leader. Enough. Fair enough. That's okay. But he should be meeting in the when uh, not even ICC officials are in, uh, are allowed into a dressing room after the problems of fixing and other things that came up. You're not allowed to go there. It's sanctum sanctorium. If you go to a temple, do they allow you into the sanctum sanctorium? You have to just uh, 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 fold your hands outside and just go from there. Well. Mr. Kirti Azad, we've seen lots of videos coming out of the dressing room where people are making poking fun at one another. You're taking videos where they're, they're having a casual time, where, they're, where players are relaxing. It's not as if this is a temple. This is a space where players really relax and, and videos come out of the dressing room every now and then. Well, we've seen um, um, cameras in the temple too, which are not allowed. No cameras are allowed inside the dressing room. That's a, these are the rules. Go through the ICC well, rules. I mean, he can easily meet. There is a private room next to it. You can go and meet people. Are, we, we used to walk around naked in our towels, not even sometimes in our, not even in our towels. It's a dressing room. Please, for God's well, sake. Well, clearly the players can. are dressed. The players are dressed. They've been told that, uh, they, I'm sure they've been told because this is not just any other person. It's Prime Minister. He comes with heavy security and a battalion. They must have been uh, informed a little prior that the Prime Minister is coming just to wish them. What's wrong? Well... The Prime Minister can go and do it in temples. He can go and dictate terms. This is sports. It's run by its own rules. It has got its own laws. Once people are not allowed, they're not allowed. This is a dressing room. This is not a meeting room. Please, for God's sake, a bedroom is not a meeting room. A, a dressing room is not a meeting room. A dressing room is very, very biased to every sportsman. So you're saying if this meeting happened in a meeting room and not a dressing room, it wouldn't have had a political spin-off to this? No, I mean, I am not saying as a politician. I'm not talking as a politician. I speak as a cricketer. They would have, would have wanted to sit down together, decide, and maybe post-mortem what the game, why, why they lost the game. There are things that have been decided. The meetings go on for hours. There is a big, nice, beautiful VIP meeting room next to the dressing room where they could have met. I'm saying as simple as that. I am I am taking this. I'm a sportsman. It's Saraswati. 
it's learning you learn how to play cricket it's saraswati and in saraswati it's like a sanctum sanctorium where you don't enter oh, okay uh, kirti azad give us some clarity on who are the people who are allowed inside the dressing room if you say that this is such a strict defined rule against who can go in and who can't uh, who are those people who are allowed inside the dressing room day in day out you people are giving comments every day about matches and who's going to do what and you people are teaching me how to play cricket at times when i listen to you people i'm sure you must have gone through the icc rules not even the dugout outside where the players are sitting anybody else apart from the players or the support staff is allowed not even in the dressing room after the match fixing and other sagas that came in it's a very strict no no rule for anybody who's not a player or not the top sports staff go and see the icc rules and you'll know not even cameras are allowed not even the the star which shows the matches are allowed to go into the dressing room if at all any of these clips that are coming are personal clips of players which are shown so well you rightly said personal clips of players come out of the dressing room it's not as if it's a it's a complete a closed area where there are no cameras allowed it it it, it happens and it's a dressing room equating that to a temple uh, isn't that a bit too much I, i'm i'm sorry that's the worst part in india we have only the winning spirit not the sportsman spirit and we don't realize how what a sanctum sanctorium for a sports person is that's unfortunate we are not yet uh, majored into a good sports nation if that is if these are the questions that you're going to ask me if it that's a sanctum sanctorium that's too much i'm sorry even kapil dev is not allowed in that dressing room who won the world cup for india for the first time you know uh, kirti azad uh, clearly this is this has happened the prime minister modi has met with those players soon after the match ended they were disappointed they were in the dressing room he's he's uh, gone up to the dressing room to wish them uh, reading too much into this uh, isn't it uh, at this time they need a little bit of encouragement the uh, team india player, players probably needed a pat on the back and very much from the prime minister why not and even if it is the dressing room now clearly they can't have a, a while they're upset and and uh, grieving over that loss you can't move all the players to another room only for the prime minister to come in maybe the prime minister was accommodating uh, a, 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 in an area where they were already comfortable and that was the dressing room when you're not comfortable in that room i mean that rooms are for planning but i don't you please try and understand these rooms are for planning these rooms are for doing post mortems before and after the match these things why why don't you just why do you take it as a kind of a studio where uh, you are changing anchors all the time in the that room i mean why don't you allow anybody else in that uh, room apart from the guests that you have invited why can't i walk into where you are sitting at the moment and just be there and say hello right, i like you rightly said the guest that we had invited even if it's a studio we have guests and we know exactly who's coming in i'm sure prime yeah. minister modi's uh, the pmo team must have given a clear indication to the prime minister going to be coming in to wish those players uh this is reading too much into it and it's not just anybody it's the prime minister with heavy security well, security enough, if if you are saying that the dressing room is closed off for anybody due to security reasons here's the prime minister that comes with security he's a verified person who has who is coming in to wish the players uh well you are arguing with me i can't do anything if you put a picture upside down and try to put water in it it won't go in so it's unfortunate part you're not understanding what i'm trying to say maybe that culture you have to learn as to what a sport is all about that's the reason right. nobody sure, sir. nobody I'll even the politician ever that's your view did the did the did the prime minister ever went to the women wrestlers when they were molested and talking about what was done to them so please don't teach me about sports and don't teach me about the decorum and decency and 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 and, and the rules and laws of the game well i'm not teaching you i'm only asking you you're giving well, me you're your uh, me. viewpoint you and i'm i'm taking that i'm mouth. taking your viewpoint of course it's my duty to cross you're question you're forcing i'm taking your, your words point into my mouth you're forcing your I'm words taking into your my point. mouth saying well, those, no, are, those, are, those are those are those are perspectives that you should there. think for yourself i'm not putting words in your mouth but kitiya thank you i really appreciate you to making your point your point taken thank you very much